Why is concrete so heavy? Well, if you were to ask a professional concrete worker, they'd probably tell you that's just to weed out the weaklings. But if you think about it here, concrete is Portland cement, sand, and gravel. And you mix it with some water and put it together, place and finish. It's made out of rocks. Of course it's heavy. I mean, we're talking about a 150 pounds per cubic foot. If we had a cube of it, a foot, you know, on all sides, 150 pounds, that's actually pretty heavy. And especially when you start talking about any kind of larger expanse or a truck full of concrete, a yard of concrete weighing more than 4,000 pounds. Aside from just all the really heavy stuff that we make the concrete with, it also undergoes consolidation where it gets vibrated or it's reduced to a viscosity that is self-leveling, something like this. Basically, there's no voids or holes or honeycombing or any kind of defects that would decrease the strength of it, ultimately making it very heavy because it's not only very heavy to start with, but there's not even the hopes of little tiny hollow pockets which would make it lighter. Concrete is definitely heavy. It's something that you just have to get over when you're working with it. You do harden off to things like 88 pound bags of cement that you have to throw around and spending, you know, eight hours on the business end of a shovel or on the business end of a trowel for that matter. Concrete working is very demanding and very hard on the body. And that is a reality and that's why you need to protect yourself appropriately when you're working with concrete. In a nutshell, the primary reason for the weight of concrete is for strength. I mean, heavy is good, right? It's strong. In fact, actually, I was thinking about this. What else is really heavy, but it's not strong at all? And I couldn't think of anything. If you can think of something, mention it in the comments below. I'd be interested to hear that. But that's what we're talking about here is very high compressive strength, super, super strong. And that's why you can have, you know, 3,000, 5,000 PSI concrete. And what that refers to is how much compressive strength you could apply to concrete before it would break, fail, crumble, ultimately be destroyed from these forces. But the tensile st strength is pretty low. That's, you know, kind of the Achilles heel of concrete is that the compressive strength is very high, but tensile strength, like picture a pencil that you break, it's very low. And that's why we embed steel within concrete in order to enhance the tensile strength and give you the best of both worlds, both compressive strength and tensile strength. So we've got this super heavy concrete, and then we just filled it full of a bunch of steel. Well, I think you have your answer there. Concrete is really heavy because it needs to be in order to be suitably strong for decades long, or maybe even a hundred years service life. But look at it this way, and it's something that they'll always tell you about concrete, is there's two facts. One, it's gonna crack. And two, nobody's going to steal it. I hope you found this information helpful.